All right, everyone, welcome back to Rainbow Comics, Cards, and Collectibles, located at 3310 South Minnesota Avenue in Sioux Falls, South Dakota, and everywhere on the World Wide Web at RainbowComicsAndCards.com. Today is Wednesday, May 25th. We will take a quick scan here of the new comic book wall for the week. And I have a really big, I have several stacks here that we're going to go over <clears throat> in a little more detail for the week. Of course, the big event this week is the DC Comics Rebirth. We have a lot of issues of DC Universe Rebirth number one available. Um, we will, uh, we opened up last night at midnight, so I'm a little groggy. <laughs> so if I'm not making sense, that's probably why. Um, we had midnight opening. We opened for an hour. We sold a lot of uh, our new comic books for the week. But we still have a really great selection to choose from. Uh, we'll get right started into it with the some trade paperbacks for the week. We have Daredevil versus Punisher, Means and Ends. Fountain trade paperback this week. We've got Munchkin, Volume Two. We have Teen Titans Go, Heroes on Patrol. That's out in trade paperback. We've got, from Marvel, of course, Spider-Man Tombstone is out in trade paperback. So if you're a fan of the old, older Spider-Man stuff, you want to check that out. From Vertigo, Black Orchid. Volume 3 of Wayward, Out from the Shadows. Volume 2 of They're Not Like Us, Us Against You, is out in trade paperback. We've got Volume 4, God World, Black Science, from Image, is out in trade paperback. And a really cool one from Dark Horse, Death Follows. Our uh, comic expert, John, has read this one, and I... I believe he says it's really looks really awesome. All right, getting into comics. All the way from A to X. It is a big week this week. We have Afterlife Archie, volume number nine. All new Chilling Tales. Check out that cover, not your usual Archie cover. We've got from Dark Horse, Aliens Defiance, issue number two. From Image, we've got Aloha, Aloha Hawaiian Dick. Um, issue number one was great, I believe. Yeah, this is issue number two. From Oni Press, we've got Another Castle. This is issue number three. From Vertigo, we've got Art Ops, issue number eight. This is Popism, part one. So a new storyline for Art Ops. From Dark Horse, we've got, uh, oh yeah, comics, Action Cat and Adventure Bug. We've got brand new, issue number eight, Back to the Future, from IDW. We have Batgirl 52. So check out that key issue. Before the rebirth, we've got Batman 66 meets the man from Uncle. This is number six. I believe this is number six of six, but it might be eight. I can't tell for sure. My eyes aren't that good after being open for the midnight release. From Boom Studios, Bill and Ted go to hell, number four of four. Oh, a big new number one. We've got Captain America number one, Steve Rogers. So check out Cap's new shield on that. You see Sam Wilson, Captain America in the background. So a new number one for Captain America, Steve Rogers version. Captain Marvel, this is I believe is issue number five. 
Join the might that is Alpha Flight. Also from Marvel, we've got Carnage, number eight. We've got Stan Lee's Chakra, the Invisible, Invincible Rise of Infinitus from Graphic India. This is $1.99, issue number one from Graphic India. We've got Cry Havoc from Image Comics. We have Cyborg number 11 from DC Comics. We have an issue that I'm looking forward to this week. Daredevil number 7 with Elektra on the cover. We've got Disney Darkwing Duck issue number 2 from Disney. We've got from DC Comics, Bombshells. Number 13 of Bombshells. This is still $3.99. It's not the new $2.99 from DC Comics. All right, the big one for the week. And the reason that we opened at midnight last night for an hour. And we sold a bunch of these, but we still have a bunch left. We've got two different covers, actually three. There's a one per store cover that we have as well. And this is DC Universe Rebirth, issue one, for $2.99. It's an 80-page comic. And it is the big one that everyone's talking about for the rebirth of the DC Comics universe. Check it out. Because we're up at midnight, I did not have a chance to read it yet. Uh, Deadpool number 12 is out this week. Blake's favorite Deadpool. I can't believe you don't like Electra, Blake. But, eh, what are you going to do? Check out the cool art right, there on Deadpool. Deathstroke 18 from DC Comics. Family Reunion. Dirk Gently's Holistic Detective Agency, A Spoon Too Short, issue number four from IDW. We've got Disney Magic Kingdom comics. So if you're looking for a good comic book for the kids to read over Memorial Day weekend, and this is actually more like a, a trade paperback, um, $6.99, a lot of pages, a lot of Disney Comics goodness. We've got Divin Divinity 2 from Valiant. Doctor Strange number 8 from Marvel. Yes, all Electra does do is cause problems for Daredevil. Doctor Who, we've got, uh, this is the 12th Doctor. We've got new 9th, I believe, 10th, and 12th. Drax, number 7 from Marvel. CM Punk can obviously write better than he can do MMA. Dreaming Eagles, number five of six, from Garth Ennis and Simon Colby. Dream Police, from Image Comics, issue 10. East of West, from Image Comics as well, issue number 26. Escape from the Dead. Sound? I'm not sure. What's the problem with the sound? Blake, is there a problem with the sound? Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas. From Hunter, Thompson, Hunter S. Thompson, of course. 
Uh, issue number one from IDW. I don't know if I want to open the inside of this. Oh, yeah. Huh. Cool. From DC Comics. The Flash. The End. Number 52. Robin Hood from Zenoscope Records. Zenoscope Records. Oh, my God. There is a Zenoscope Records, but that's beside the point. <laughs> Robin Hood, 2016 Annual. Hard-Hearted. Probably because I have an up since midnight. Actually, I did sleep a little bit. Another one from Zenoscope. For Mature Readers. Satan's Hollow. Number three of six. Ghostbusters International from IDW. Number five for Ghostbusters International. Grayson from DC Comics. Number 20. There's one hiding behind that there. Oh, Marvel. Guardians of the Galaxy. Issue number eight. We've got from Oni Press, Heartthrob. I believe this is issue number two of Heartthrob. Real good critically acclaimed comic was Heartthrob. We've got Hyperion, issue number three from Marvel. The Uncanny Inhumans from Marvel. This is issue number nine. We've got a rock and roll biography, it looks like here. Iron Maiden. For you Iron Maiden fans. Continuing on with the rock and roll theme. <laughs> Gem and the Holograms from IDW. Issue number 15. We've got another Garth Ennis one. This time with Keith Burns from Titan Comics. Johnny Red. So if you're into war comics, these have been... Uh, Really cool, really great. Awesome art, good stories. We've got number four of Jonesy from Boombox. Number six of Judge Dredd from IDW. For you Judge Dredd fans, like Mr. Zack. Justice League, DC Comics, number 50. The Legacy of Luther Strode, issue number 6 from Image. From Dark Horse, we've got a number 1 of 3. Lobster Johnson, Metal Monsters of Midtown. Oh no, Midtown's under attack again. We've got the Marvel previews. So this is for August. Marvel Comics previews. For those of you who would like to pre-order and make sure that you get the comics you want, uh, stop down to the store. Ask us how that works. From Marvel, we've got Mockingbird. Issue number three of Mockingbird. Ah, one of my top five comics for sure from the last year monstrous issue number six is out from marvel issue number seven of moon girl and devil dinosaur miss marvel the road to civil war two miss marvel issue number seven We've got Munchkin, number 17, from Boombox. So a new Munchkin comic. We've got a new number one from Marvel. Nighthawk, number one. So, check that out for you Nighthawk fans. We've got from DC Comics, issue 12 of The Omega Men. Orphan Black, Kill Switch from IDW. We've got Patsy Walker, aka Hellcat, issue number six. 
And we've got the big, thick previews book that has everything from all the major publishers. Um, the one I showed before was just the Marvel previews. This is uh, the June 2016 version of previews, which would be for pre-ordering August comics. So basically, if you pre-order uh, two months in advance, we have a, a pull list account system we'll set you up with and get you going on that. We've got Rachel Rising. This is the final issue of Rachel Rising. From Marvel, Red Wolf, number six. All right, Blake's at, Blake has to take the kids to daycare. We'll see you later, Blake. See you at noon for our live weekly comic book show with music by Blake. Rick and Morty, number 14 from Oni Press. Scooby Apocalypse, an all-new number one. Check out that cool cover for Scooby Apocalypse. Secret Six from DC Comics, number 14. Sex, issue number 28 from Image Comics. Shaft Imitation of Life. This is part four, All the World's Stage. We have Sonic Universe, issue 85, from Archie and Sega. We've got The Amazing Spider-Man 1.5, Amazing Grace, part five, from Marvel. Spider-Man Deadpool team up. This is issue number four of Spidey. And Deadpool. Squarriors from Devil's Due First Comics. This is issue number one. Squarriors and the meek shall inherit the earth. Star Wars number 19 is new this week. Star Wars Obi-Wan and Anakin issue number five is out this week. Issue number six of Starbrand and Nightmask from Marvel Comics. We've got Starve from Image Comics. This is issue number nine, I believe, of Starve. From Aftershock Comics, Strayer, number four. From IDW, we've got issue number four as well of Street Fighter G.I. Joe. We've got DC Comics, Suicide Squad, Most Wanted, Deadshot, and Katana. There can only be one. This is issue number five of five, I believe. Yes. One of my favorite comics, Suiciders, Kings of Hell A. I believe this is issue number three. Yep, issue number three. Suiciders, Kings of Hell A. It's been my pick before. Definitely reading that one this week. One my girls will definitely be reading. Adventures of Su Supergirl, issue number two. Based on the CBS, well now CW, I guess you might have to say, series. So issue number two is Supergirl, $2.99. Again, pick up some good reading materials for the kids for Memorial Day weekend road trip. Or sitting in the cabin if it rains out, they can read some new comics. We have Superman, issue number 52. There's the new 52 variant cover on that one. We've got, again, my first personal favorite Superman comic that's out right now. Uh, Superman, Lois and Clark, issue number 8. We've got Tarot. Jim, Bal Jim Balance Tarot, Witch of the Black Rose. I believe this is issue May, and number 98. Of course, for mature readers, $2.95 on that one. We've got from 
DC Comics Teen Titans, issue number 20, Fall of the Titans. Number seven of the Mighty Thor. So you've got your new Jane Foster Thor there. Nickelodeon Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Amazing Adventures from IDW. This is a one shot. Tokyo Ghost, number seven, from Image Comics. We've got a new Action Lab, Tomboy, issue number five. We've got from Creature Comics, we've got Tommy, issue number two. What's the name of the White Rabbit, John? Horace? The Totally Awesome Hulk. We've got issue number six from Marvel. A new Transformers from IDW. Issue number 53 of Transformers. We've got Ultimate Spider-Man. Web Warriors. Issue number three. Ultra Cat. From, I believe this is from Antarctic Press, yes. So, Ultra Cat. I don't know. Might be a good one for cat lovers. We've got the Unbeatable Squirrel Girl. This is issue number eight of the Unbeatable Squirrel Girl. We Are Robin, issue number 12. From Marvel Comics, issue number six of Weird World. We've got Welcome Back, issue number eight from Boom Studios. We've got issue number two of the new X-Files. Mulder on the cover there. And we've got Extraordinary X-Men, issue number ten. And we've got the worst... X-Man ever, number four of five. So once again, it's a big week this week. We, of course, have the DC Universe Rebirth. We have a new Captain America, number one, with, uh, of course, with the Steve Rogers version. So check it out. New comic books for the week of May 25th, 2016. Rainbow Comics, Cards and Collectibles, 3310 South Minnesota Avenue in Sioux Falls, South Dakota, and everywhere on the World Wide Web at RainbowComicsAndCards.com. Be sure to tune in at noon for our live weekly comic book show. Thanks, folks. See you next week.